the long-anticipated Affinity sidechain, by engine is coming this year, and because Ethereum 2 is more congested than ever, blockchain games and dApps start migrating to Matic Network, a faster and cheaper Layer 2 solution that achieves scale by, utilizing sidechains for off-chain computation. Wax and Arcane Network lowered the adoption barrier by making blockchain gaming accessible to gamers with the use of a simple account. The situation is getting serious, are you ready to begin? Here are some of the best blockchain games to play in 2021. Ten. The Sandbox The Sandbox is free to play, but if you want land plots you have to buy them. The Sandbox is a virtual gaming world on the Ethereum network where you can create your own custom experiences and play with others. Join your friends in different worlds or try to survive solo. By creating your avatar, you will enjoy a more social and multiplayer experience. With Vox Edit. You can create assets and upload them to the in-game marketplace as ERC-1155 tokens. You can use these assets in the game or sell them to other players. The game features its native currency, the dollar sand, which serves as the currency for all players' transactions. It's an ERC-20, Ethereum, token, and some of its use cases are to purchase assets and land from the marketplace or even stake it for rewards mining. Dollar Sand is available at various exchanges, including Binance, allowing players to trade them for other cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin and Ethereum. Each land parcel inside the game, the Six Dragons. The Six Dragons are completely free to play and you can start earning right away. The Six Dragons is an open world RPG blockchain game with a billion randomly generated dungeons and a massive map full of adventures. Players fight various monsters to gain experience and drops. Some of the items you can pick up are blockchain-based assets that you sell right away or use to craft items and perform enchants. The roadmap contains multiplayer aspects implementation. Are you brave enough to defeat the Six Dragons? Be careful when you explore the map. The Six Dragons will launch a PlayStation 5 version of the game in Q4 2021. Besides, the game features governance NFT tokens and enables DeFi slash yield farming. The Six Dragons is part of Engine's multiverse interconnected games. Try other blockchain games to play with the TSD items, you will get amazed. The in-game currency, dollar $TSDT, is pegged 1 to 1 to dollar $ENJ, meaning that $1 TSDT will always be $1 ENJ. 8. Splinterlands you can try Splinterlands for free, but to unlock rewards you need to buy the starter set for $10. Known for its fast-paced gameplay, Splinterlands is a card game where you build a deck every time before the battle begins. Each fight is automated, and results come in instantly, allowing you to play many games in a short period. Once the game matches you with an opponent of your skills, the battle rules appear with different terms and limitations every time. One deck is never enough but fear not. The game will reward you over time with cards and other goodies. So, smash your enemies and climb up the leaderboard for better rewards. How to earn in Splinterlands? Earn deck tokens for every victory you achieve. At the end of each season that lasts 15 days, players also earn cards and deck tokens based on the highest league achieved. The game also features tournaments for extra rewards. Trade deck tokens for Ethereum at Uniswap Exchange and secure your play to earn rewards from volatility, hold, or stake them to earn yield slash defy rewards. Extensive gameplay with land ownership. The land is an upcoming implementation that aims to enhance the gameplay. Splinterlands hosted a series of sold-out pre-sales to distribute the land that lasted a few minutes. From what we know so far, the land implementation is part of a planned expansion which is the most significant update in the game's history. The update includes new types of cards and significant improvements in the battle system. Splinterlands is one of the most played blockchain games with thousands of unique active players and daily transaction volume. To start with the game, 
you have to purchase a starter set for $10. Before you proceed, you can try the game for free and decide later if you want to buy the starter set and unlock the game's full potentials, including in-game rewards. Deck token is the game currency that handles the Splinterlands economy. Players earn deck tokens in various ways, such as destroying unused cards or rewards for achieving victories. 7. Axie Infinity You need three axes to form a team and start playing. Ronin sidechain pending for the game and NFTs. Axie Infinity is a Pokemon-inspired pet breeding and PvP fighting blockchain game. The game has various play-to-earn mechanics, including daily tasks that reward you with SLP potions. You can use SLP tokens for breeding two axes and creating your breeding farm. All axes can be sold in the in-game marketplace, which enjoys tremendous growth. Binance provides an SLP slash ETH pair to profit from your in-game rewards. Axie Infinity Shards, AXS, is the ERC20 governance token. AXS holders have voting rights and can stake their tokens to claim DeFi rewards. You can trade AXS tokens at the Binance exchange. The Ronin Sidechain Ronin is an Ethereum sidechain under development by Sky Mavis, the company behind Axie Infinity. With Ronin, Axie Infinity aims to provide free and fast transactions to the gameplay and a seamless experience. Axie Infinity is one of the most playable games ever and the ones with the most growth. Players from Indonesia, Venezuela, and other countries play Axie Infinity daily to sustain their households and pay for their expenses. 6. Gods Unchained Gods Unchained is free to play and you can win a lot of cards by playing. Gods Unchained is a hybrid TCG game on the Ethereum blockchain similar to Hearthstone and Magic the Gathering. Players fight in PvP battles and tournaments to rank up and win cards. You can use your cards to build a stronger deck or sell them to other players for ETH. Genesis cards come in the form of ERC721 tokens, and their price depends on the rarity and the quantity in circulation. Make sure to sign up for the upcoming World Championship Tournament which offers a prize pool of $570,000 and still counting. The high demand for in-game cards makes them extremely valuable. The game has a big transaction volume and thousands of active players, meaning that you most likely find a buyer for the cards earned quickly. The game is free to play as it provides free cards to new users. When you start playing, you can earn cards with real value right away. It's worth mentioning that Gods Unchained is one of the most popular blockchain games that has managed to onboard thousands of players unaware of blockchain gaming. With over $7 million in card trades, and Chris Clay as a manager, former game director of Magic, The Gathering Arena, the game has the potentials to go mainstream. 5. Blanco's Block Party You can play Blanco's Block Party for free with a basic figure and purchase additional Blancos or items. Blanco's Block Party is a fun MMO game where you can compete with other players in various activities. Anyone can build a map, challenge others on adventures, create and participate in any gameplay, including racing or shooting minigames. Some Blancos and items in the game are EOS-based tokenized NFTs. Users collect and trade different kinds of Blancos and items. The game is free to play for everyone. Every new player will get a free non-tradable Blanco to start with the game. Although the game is free to play, there is an option to buy cosmetics, accessories, and limited edition Blancos with real-life value. Without a doubt, Blanco's Block Party is one of the best blockchain games to play in 2021. Moolah Token By playing Blancos, users can earn Moolah Tokens. You can buy items in the game using Moolah and sell them to others at the marketplace for crypto to monetize your gameplay. 4. War Riders While War Riders are free to play, you will need some guns, or at least, drive away fast. Inspired by the famous movie Mad Max, War Rider is a post-apocalyptic MMO blockchain game where you can blow up cars, mine BZN tokens, customize and upgrade your car and weapons. BZN token is the only form of payment in the wasteland, and players can use it as a currency in the game or trade it. There are four ways to earn for more riders. 
drive your way to BZN waypoints, mine BZN, and return safely to your garage to secure your earnings. Steal other players on the go and again return safely to your garage. Rent your garage to other players. Trade in-game cars and weapons with others from the in-game marketplace or open. C. At the time, BZN is not available at any exchanges. Until then, you have the option to sell them at OpenSea. Stay tuned for more info. War Riders are free to play. You will be granted a free, non-tradable, vehicle upon creating a new account. 3. Light Knight While War Riders are free to play, you will need some guns, or at least, drive away fast. Light Knight is a low polygraphics PvP game that works using Bitcoin's lighting network. The Battle Royale gameplay will grant you some rewards in Satoshi based on your gaming skills. Players earn Bitcoin every time they shoot an opponent and lose every time they get hit. The single player, as well as multiplayer modes, will keep you occupied for a while. Also, you can sell every item you loot in the game. The game is currently available in early access with multiplayer mode. To play you need early access which comes at the price of $20 with an avatar. Visit Light Knight using our link and receive a limited edition gamer skin and a 30% discount. Beta is expected for September 2021. 2. Lost Relics Lost Relics is a fun top-down RPG game to play powered by the engine blockchain. Lost Relics, formerly Forgotten Artifacts, is an action role-playing blockchain game where you can loot engine-backed items during dungeon adventures. The more you level up, the harder it becomes to kill monsters, but the loot is much better than before. To start with the game, connect your engine wallet and summon one adventure stone to play. You can purchase adventure stones in the shop or win some in the practice dungeon. The game doesn't offer a PvP experience yet, as it is still in the early stages of development. During the era when the great beasts of old lived upon the ground, the clans of the Northern Realm grew vast in number and spread out across the land. In all manner of things, the people of the clans acquired insight and wisdom from the elemental to the arcane, passing this knowledge down from generation to generation. This time was known as the first eon and is where the very first historical records can be traced back. It was within this period that scribes first sought to record that which occurred at the time, leaving behind an account for those of the future to look upon. As with any world that endures through the ages, there were times of good and times of bad, from prosperity brought about by the emergence of trade to the dark days in the wake of the great eruption of Mount Okep and the time of the long winter that followed. Though the single most significant event to occur in history did not originate in Okep nor any other land to be found in this world. It originated with those from other places in the universe. Two obstinate races, with intellects ascended yet fierce, were entwined in a battle of colossal scale called the Deception Bear. The Deception War resulted in much loss of life, knowledge, and power. The only remaining remnants of the war lay forgotten, scattered around the universe. To this day, they are known as the Lost Relics. 1. Mega Cryptopolis Mega Cryptopolis is one of the oldest blockchain games with over $4.5 billion in rewards since 2018. Mega Cryptopolis is a city-building simulation game operating on both Ethereum, Matic, and Tron networks. The game implements NFT trading, resources gathering, business building, land ownership, and mega token rewards. Players populate the game's map, and anyone can display and sell NFT items inside a building. Items and resources come in the form of ERC-721 tokens meaning that each one has its value. Besides, users can complete missions to earn Mega Rewards. Mega is an ERC-20 DeFi powered token used to handle the economy of the game. Players earn Mega Token Yield Rewards while playing. The game has paid out more than $4.5 million to its players since 2018. MCP has one of the highest payouts from all blockchain games to play to early investors. Mega holders may also operate liquidity mining operations to earn fees providing liquidity by adding Mega to pools on Uniswap, Ethereum, or just Swap, Tron Network. 
It's a breakthrough online multiplayer strategy game that allows players from all over the world to collectively build a unique mega city like never before. Every asset in the Mega Cryptopolis is a cryptographically unique ERC721 token stored in a player's wallet. Game logic runs entirely on smart contracts with every action rendering a verified transaction on the blockchain. Mega Crypto Polis is based on a decentralized model, with all in-game transactions verified by smart contracts and all player activities stored within the Ethereum blockchain. Mega Crypto Polis 3D allows players to rent buildings, produce materials that are required by other buildings, create new generations of citizens, offer services to other players, place ads and drive cars, just to name a few. New microeconomy concept with a set of new functions for all the building types. Residential buildings will produce citizen tokens that are required to maintain operations in other buildings. Offices will give citizens jobs to earn ether. Commercial buildings will help citizens restore their stamina and allow changing in appearance for a small fee in ether. Municipal building will receive insurance funds in case of natural disaster in the district. Industrial will produce basic materials required to construct new buildings. Production buildings make complex materials required to upgrade. Energy buildings, constructed near resource spots will produce electricity and water that are required for other buildings to operate. Please share this video to your friends, comment, like and subscribe to see new and exiting videos.